So I just drove into Key Largo. I got the checkmate behind me. We're gonna go visit a friend that's building a houseboat. I'm gonna help him with a little bit of labor and I'm gonna help him with exposure because he wants to rent this thing as an Airbnb. And I know a lot of you guys are gonna really appreciate this because I get messages all the time. Where can I stay? What do you recommend me to do? I wanna take my boat, I don't wanna take my family out. I'm about to show you guys the vibe, all right? You're gonna, you guys wanna bring your boat to Key Largo. You guys are gonna wanna launch out a Caribbean club and you guys are gonna wanna go rent this houseboat out for the weekend. Here we are, Caribbean club. Oh, coming in hot. Bam. This place does not look like this on a weekend. Yeah, that's how I launch my boat every single time. Cold start. I'm currently running a 24 ET prop. Completely run prop again for this boat. I'm trying to find a 26 Pro Max or a 27 Pro Max. This ET prop it's not going to take off good, but look, look at it. Cavitates, but... You play with it a little bit and it takes off. But yeah, good vibes. And for those of you wondering if I, if I put on my drain plug, yes I did. I just thought about it myself, I'm like, did I put on my drain plug? I put on my drain plug at the house. Hey, I'm just being honest. So I've either matured or I've spent a lot of money or both. But I'm not trying to break the boat. I'm trimmed down, taking it easy. We're cruising like a 45, 50, but yeah, I'm enjoying myself. I forgot to record, I just did a little flyby for them. But here's the houseboat. It's still a work in progress, it's not furnished, it's not neat yet, but it's gonna be a good vibe, trust me. So this houseboat is in Isla Morada. It's five minutes away from the Tiki Bar. So right now I'm working on getting these little brackets done. 
to secure this pole that I just finished cutting. You see, I have these little anchors and rivets. That's what I'm gonna be doing right now. But here's the main stateroom. Huge window. Which I could do, but there's no space for it. There's no space underneath. Okay. For it. Again, a vertical installation would have solved that problem, but that's that's what we have. It's not gonna matter. It's gonna work just fine. Nothing crazy, but extremely comfortable and 100 percent off grid. Another room here, and the guys are working on the electrical. All right, so this is gonna go somewhere like this. I wish I had a cameraman. So there she is, the mothership. Just wait till we have the front cabana, the top, with all the lights and all the water toys, it's gonna be perfect. So it's getting late. I really don't want to be out here by myself at night. Sunset's about to start going down. Stay tuned for more videos. I'm going to be doing more, I guess, videos on the new houseboat that we're going to be renting out. If you guys are interested in renting this houseboat, reach out to me. Email is in the description. My Instagram is Boat Vibes. It's going to be fun. Expect a lot more content on this thing. Let's ride. I hate this prop. What a perfect way to end the video. Stay tuned for the next one. I hope you guys enjoyed this random vlog. Stay tuned for the next video. I don't know what else to tell you.